I genuinely don't have the words to describe the horrors that happened today. They disguised themselves as fucking aid workers. They Trojan horsed themselves as aid workers into a fucking refugee camp. They used the $300 million port, the fucking US humanitarian aid, humanitarian assistant port, to fucking smuggle US soldiers into Gaza, into a refugee camp, disguised as fucking aid workers. And when Palestinians, starving Palestinians, because need we forget, around a million are predicted to die from starvation and other genocide related like things, lack of healthcare, etc., etc., the ongoing bombardment. When they saw a fucking aid truck come into this densely populated refugee camp full of displaced people, they obviously tried to open the doors. They tried to get in. They tried to see what it was up, what the fuck was happening. And so they massacred people. They massacred people that discovered them. 210 Palestinians, mostly children, were massacred today because the US used their ports, the US used their soldiers, and Israel disguised themselves as aid workers and then massacred, completely annihilated children. Children. To save four fucking people. And this is the shit that our politicians say is a glimmer of hope. David Lammy's already released a tweet saying that this is a day to be thankful. This is a glimmer of hope. Politicians in the West are celebrating the rescuing of four hostages and the mass murder of 200, mostly children, Palestinians. After the occupation forces disguised themselves as fucking aid workers and used a humanitarian truck to get into a civilian area and then massacred civilians. Can you imagine for one second if four Palestinian hostages were rescued and 210 Israeli children were murdered? What the headlines would be, what the people would say. It is fucking barbaric that anyone is celebrating today.